Hey guys, it's Randy here at eTrailer.com. Today we're taking a look at a ratchet strap from Ericsson. This is going to be in the lighter duty line. Does a great job of securing items like ATVs, UTVs, loads of lumber, whatever you might need to strap down, it's going to give you a good way to do it. The strap itself is very similar to most ratchet straps, but something that we have on each end is going to be the floating D-ring. Not only will we be able to use the J-hook to connect directly to our trailer, but we can also loop it around items, use that D-ring as an additional connection point. As far as light duty straps go, this one's really solid and really well built. Nice sturdy steel construction, you can see the release there to get it in the different positions, whether that's locked all the way down, ratcheting in the middle position, or even all the way out, you'll see it releases its tension there. We wanna reapply the tension, we move it down, just ratchet it back up. The handle has a good length to it. We're able to apply a good amount of torque on there and get our items secure. You'll notice it's not just a flat piece of steel you're pulling on. It's got a little bit of a tab there. It's gonna spread that out over a greater area, allow us to get good torque on there without hurting our hands. And the release you can see is the same way. Easy to get to, easy to operate. Now the strap is gonna be one inch wide. And as far as light duty straps go, this is probably about as thick as you're going to find. It's a really nice resilient feel to it. I don't think you'll have any issues for, with it for a long time to come. Now with 15 feet in length, this strap's going to really help you secure just about any type of item that you might want to. It has a safe working load limit of 1,000 pounds. That's something you don't want to exceed. And we always recommend that you use more than one strap to secure any item in, just to give you some backup in case you have a failure in one. Now to get our strap installed, we'll need to take the tag end and we want to run it through the center barrel in the strap ratchet itself. So we're going to pull that out and we just need to loop it back over, take it out of the handle side. Now when attaching it to your connection point, you can either bring it down, use that double J hook and connect it, or something I like about this strap, the additional feature, with a round tube like this, we can use our D ring. So bring that around. connect that hook to the D-ring, and that's gonna give us a nice connection point also. We're gonna pull most of that tension out of the excess there, and then just begin to use our ratchet, get our torque applied. At that point, we'll tidy up whatever excess that we're gonna have, and put on a couple straps, we'll be ready to head down the road.